10 Best Digital Products to Sell in 2023 This YouTube channel discusses various tutorials about Canva and helps you earn money with Canva so make sure you give thumbs up, comments, and subscribe to this channel because thumbs up, comments, and subscribe are free guys. This video is all about the top digital products to sell. Digital products are becoming increasingly popular as a way to make money online. I'll outline some of the most lucrative digital goods you may offer for sale online in this video. The first idea is that you can sell ebooks. Ebooks are a popular choice for digital product sellers because they can be easily created and accessed by customers. They can cover a wide range of topics and can be sold through various platforms, including Amazon Kindle Direct Publishing and Apple Books. Now, let's talk about what kind of ebook you might want to sell. There are many different options, including fiction, nonfiction, educational, self help, and more. Consider your strengths and interests, and think about what kind of information you have to share that could be valuable to others. When it comes to selling ebooks, timing is important. Consider releasing your ebook at a time when it is likely to get the most visibility, such as when it aligns with a holiday or a current event. You can also consider offering promotions or discounts to encourage sales. Ebooks can also be offered as part of a larger product bundle or as a standalone product. For example, if you are a self help coach, you can create an ebook on how to overcome anxiety and sell it on Amazon Kindle Direct Publishing. Number two on today's list is an online course. If you have expertise in a particular subject, consider creating an online course to share your knowledge with others. Now, let's talk about what kinds of online courses you can sell. The options are endless, but some popular topics include business, marketing, technology, health and wellness, and personal development. Online courses can be hosted on platforms such as Udemy or Teachable and can be offered in various formats, including video, audio, and text. For example, if you are a yoga instructor, you can create an online course on how to practice yoga at home and sell it on Udemy. Digital product number three sells printables. Printables are a great digital product to sell because they're easy to create and distribute. All you need is a computer and some design software, and you can create a wide range of printables that can be sold over and over again. Plus, printables are highly customizable, which means you can create a product that meets the specific needs of your customers. If you don't know what printable items to sell then the answer is there are many types of printables you can sell, including planners, worksheets, templates and more. Some ideas for printables include meal planning templates, budgeting worksheets, exercise or fitness planners, recipe cards, project management templates, coloring pages and more. Once you've created printables and you're confused about where to sell them, you can sell your printables on your own website, Etsy, and other online marketplaces. You can also sell printables through affiliates or by offering them as a free bonus for other products you sell. If you are confused about when to sell it then my answer is printables can be sold year-round, but there are certain times of the year when they may be particularly popular. For example, planners and budgeting worksheets may be in high demand at the beginning of the year, and fitness planners or recipe cards may be popular around the new year too when people are looking to make healthy lifestyle changes. Digital products in fourth place are stock photos, professional photographers can sell their images to companies or individuals who need high-quality photos for their projects. Stock photo websites such as Shutterstock and iStock allow photographers to upload and sell their photos to a wider audience. To create successful stock photos, it's important to focus on high-demand subjects such as travel, food, and business, use professional equipment and lighting, and follow the guidelines and requirements of the stock photo website. Now we discuss the fifth order is fonts and graphics. Graphic designers can create and sell their own fonts and graphics to others in need of unique design elements. These can be sold as digital files through websites like Creative Market or as physical products through print-on-demand services. For example, if you are a graphic designer, you can create and sell a pack of hand-drawn fonts on Creative Market. To create successful fonts and graphics, it's important to showcase your unique style and offer a wide range of subjects and themes, use high-quality graphics and resolution, and provide clear instructions on how to use the product. 
The next order you can make an app for you to sell. If you have programming skills, consider creating and selling your own app. Apps can be sold through app stores such as the Apple App Store or Google Play Store and can be offered for free with in-app purchases or as paid downloads. For example, if you are a fitness instructor, you can create an app that provides workout routines and nutrition plans and sell it on the Apple App Store. To create a successful app, it's important to identify a unique problem that your app can solve, create a user-friendly and visually appealing design, and test the app thoroughly before launching it. In seventh place is the WordPress template, why sell WordPress themes and plugins? There are several reasons why selling WordPress themes and plugins can be a lucrative business. First, WordPress is the most popular content management system in the world, meaning there is a large and constantly growing market for themes and plugins. Where can you sell WordPress themes and plugins? There are several places where you can sell WordPress themes and plugins. The official WordPress theme and plugin repositories are popular options, as well as marketplaces like ThemeForest and CodeCanyon. You can also sell your products directly through your own website. Digital product in 8th place is selling music, but the question is what types of audio or music tracks can be sold? There are many different types of audio or music tracks that can be sold as digital products. This can include original compositions, sound effects, loops, and even royalty-free tracks that can be used in a variety of projects. A frequently asked question is where can digital audio or music tracks be sold? There are several places where digital audio or music tracks can be sold. One option is to sell them through a platform like Audio Jungle or Musicbed, which specialize in selling royalty-free audio and music tracks to businesses and content creators. Once we know where to sell it, most people don't know how to promote it, there are several ways to promote and sell digital audio or music tracks. One option is to use social media platforms like Instagram or TikTok to showcase your tracks and attract potential buyers. You can also use email marketing or paid advertising to promote your tracks to a wider audience. The target audience for digital audio or music tracks can vary depending on the type of tracks you create. For example, original compositions may be more appealing to music supervisors or film and television producers, while sound effects or loops may be more attractive to video game developers or advertisers. There are many successful sellers of digital audio or music tracks, including Brian Tyler, a composer who has created music for films like Iron Man 3 and Avengers, Age of Ultron and has sold his tracks on Audio Jungle. The Musicbed, a platform that specializes in selling royalty-free music tracks to businesses and content creators. Premium Beat, another platform that sells royalty-free music tracks to businesses and content creators. On the 9th you can sell and hold virtual events, with the rise of virtual events due to the pandemic, consider hosting and selling tickets to your own virtual event. Virtual events can be hosted through platforms like Zoom or Google Meet and can be offered as live or pre-recorded events. For example, if you are a motivational speaker, you can host a virtual event on how to overcome adversity and sell tickets on Eventbrite. To create a successful virtual event, it's important to identify a unique topic and format, promote your event through social media and email marketing, and offer high-quality audio and visual elements. On the last list in this video is memberships, offer exclusive content or access to your services through a membership program. Memberships can be offered on a monthly or yearly basis and can include access to special resources, discounts, or personalized support. For example, if you are a fitness instructor, you can offer a membership program that provides access to exclusive workout routines, nutrition plans, and coaching sessions. To create a successful membership program, it's important to identify a unique value proposition and offer exclusive and high-quality content, use a user-friendly and secure platform to manage membership, and provide excellent customer support. If you like this video please hit the thumbs up and subscribe buttons and leave a comment below this video to let me know your thoughts. If you have any questions please drop me a comment below this video to let me know what you would like to see next and what type of videos you want me to create for you. I will be able to respond back to you as soon as possible also be sure to check out our other videos as well. Thanks for watching.